I have a ton of vegetables in here that I need to use up. So let's use this and then I'm going to get this zucchini and then some of these baby carrots too. I give these to my kids for their lunch. I know exactly what I'm going to make with these vegetables. If you have some half eaten, mismatched, sorry looking vegetables in your fridge, you know it's time to make minestrone soup. Or like my aunt, who's Italian, pronounces it minestrone. Minestrone soup is an Italian soup and it's vegetable based, but you can use up any vegetables you want for minestrone soup. And that's why I'm using this sorry group of vegetables here in my recipe. But typically minestrone soup has onions, rice, beans, celery, carrots, even pasta sometimes. You can customize it however you want. There's no right or wrong way of doing it, but I'm gonna show you how you can turn this Italian classic into a low carb bowl of comfort. Let's get focused on cooking. We're gonna start by dicing up our vegetables. So once again, I'm using zucchini, some red onion and carrot, and you just wanna chop these up into just bite-sized chunks. Now, when it comes to carrot on the keto diet, you can totally omit this because they are higher in carbs, but really they're not gonna add that much carbohydrate to our soup. And I just like them in there for flavor and for appearance too. It's nice to have a little orange ball of carrot in your soup. Once our veggies are diced up, I'm gonna add two slices of bacon that I've diced up into a large stock pot. We're gonna cook this until the fat starts to render and our bacon is getting kind of crispy and then add in our vegetables. We're gonna add in the carrots, the onion, and the celery. Once those are softened, next up I'm gonna add in my diced zucchini, along with a 28 ounce can of whole tomatoes, and then four cups of chicken broth. You can use vegetable broth if you want. Um, vegetable broth is actually a little bit higher in carbs though, so I'm gonna use chicken broth or you can use water, and a teaspoon of salt for flavor. We're gonna test that just to see where we're at. Just missing something. Ah, I know what it is. The Parmesan rind. Many say that a true minestrone soup uses the rind of Parmesan cheese within it just to add that umami flavor. And it really does help just because it's allowed to simmer in your soup base for a long period of time and all those yummy flavors leach out into your soup. We're gonna bring this to a boil and then turn down the heat and let it simmer slowly over 20 minutes. Obviously, the longer you let it cook, the more of that umami flavor from the Parmesan cheese rind is gonna seep out into your soup, but I really just wanna get this done. So my Italian aunt, she lives on a ranch. It's a sixth generation ranch that's been in my family and she uses beef shanks in her minestrone soup and it's really good, adds a ton of flavor and she lets it cook all day long. So that slow cooking actually adds a ton of flavor from those bones from the beef into our broth. But we're not gonna do that. This is just a easy 30 minute recipe. Now that my vegetables are tender, I'm gonna add in a few more ingredients one cup of cauliflower rice, and then instead of kidney or northern beans, which is typically found in a lot of minestrone soup recipes, I'm gonna be using the only low carb bean that I know of, which is the lupini bean. Lupini beans, it's a legume and they're higher in fiber. So a quarter cup of lupini beans is actually two grams of net carbs. So I'm gonna be adding in one cup of these lupini beans to this soup. And of course, if you don't wanna use these beans, well then just use the cauliflower rice and omit the beans altogether three cups of baby spinach leaves, now let's take out the rind and have a taste test.
That Parmesan cheese rime is everything in this recipe. It's so good, it's good, it's good. I love the thick chunks of vegetables in here. And this is gonna help keep me warm because I gotta go rake some leaves now and it's cold outside. If you guys are looking for some more keto soup recipes, make sure you click right here.